Hello my preschool friends, it's Mrs. Amber and welcome to our circle time video. Behind me is of course our learning board, but before we do that, let's get started with our hello song. Hello my preschool friends, how are you? Hello my preschool friends, how are you? It's time to start our day, we're here to laugh and play. Hello my preschool friends, how are you? How are you guys doing today? Did you have a good weekend? Good! All right, let's go over our learning board. It'll probably be a little bit quick because I don't have a story or an activity besides the little learning activities that I gave your grown-ups to do. So hopefully you'll have a lot of time today to play and to imagine things, maybe create something. If you do that, have your grown-up send me a picture or a video of you doing that. I'd love to see. All right. It is our tree study for a little while longer, probably about two more weeks. Today's date of this video is November 9th, 2020. Our schedule for this video is our hello song, which we did, our learning board, which we're doing now, and then you have in your um, packets that I sent a while ago a um, little story reader book. I want you guys, your grown-ups can read them the first time, but from then I want you guys to try to read it. Maybe read the pictures, tell your grown-ups what's happening in them. And it'll help you when you go off to kindergarten, if you're going into kindergarten next year or maybe the year after that, you guys are already started reading. So you're making your brains big by practicing those skills that you'll do in kindergarten. All right, today's focus question is what can you make from a tree? So what sort of things can you make from a tree? Houses, houses are made from wood and wood comes from trees. I, um, my uncle, my uncle has a um, canoe that's made of wood and it's really shiny and you can kind of see like the little circles and rings that the tree used to have that um, was before he made the canoe, which is pretty, pretty cool. What else do you think you can make out of a tree? Mm. What about parts of a tree? All the limbs and stuff that fall, do you think you can make something of those? Maybe. I've made little ornaments and wreaths out of um, branches from trees and the pine cones that fall from trees. And that's pretty fun. I might do that again this year because the holidays are coming up and my family celebrates Christmas. So that'll be really cool to see. All right, well, if you do make something from a tree or your grown up makes something from a tree or parts of the tree, go ahead and let me know about it. I love to see. All right, like I said, this isn't a very long video, but we do have one more important thing to talk, do. It's our letter, of course. This week's letter is K. Can you say K? Good, K makes the K, K, K sound. It's very similar sound to, K, to C, but C also says S, K doesn't, it just says K. All right, how you draw K is a straight line down. Then you have this little, it looks like an alligator mouth, kind of open like this. So you go little diagonal to the middle and then little diagonal down. All right, are you guys practicing your letters at home? Oh, of course you are, I'm so glad. If you wanna challenge yourself, try practicing writing the letters or maybe even writing your name. Can you think of any words that start with K or a K sound? That's a good one. I always think of like someone's name, like Catherine, or um, maybe karaoke. Karaoke starts with a K. Some K names are kind of hard to think of. Usually the K is at the end of the word. <gasps> kangaroo, kangaroo is a great K word. Great job, my friends. You sure are making your brains bigger with all those uh, letters that we've learned. All right, my friends, now it's the end, I know. Well, later today I'll have a, a second step lesson that you guys can join me for. All right, I will see you then. Bye for now, my friends.